All right, everyone, Maharab is here, and I just created a quick small video, which is kind of an extension to my previous video because I wanted to clear up a small mistake I made. I said in that video. Secondly, if you have two characters of the same element, only one sampler will shine with the element. Just something I wanted to clear. The thing is, I mostly make video based on what I read, and it takes some time for me to fully edit the video to upload it. And in the meantime, it just made sense to me that since our samplers record elements as opposed to characters, if you have two characters of the same element, only one sampler will shine with that element, and the other two will remain Geo. But then you guys told me that that's not the case. If there are two characters of the same element, two of her samplers will record it, and she will proc the resistance shred. Firstly, I didn't believe it because I don't believe everything anyone says, nor do I watch any other content creator's videos before making my own, because this way, I get to show you guys the way I feel about the character, not how anyone else describes it. But then I looked at her gameplay with different teams, and it is indeed true that two of the same elemental characters can still proc her soundscapes, and this changes everything. Where a Geo character was supposed to play with different elemental characters, she is now going to be a core part of mono elemental teams. But how? You see, Kazaha has been the most important core of mono elemental teams for a very long time. Whether it's Mono Cryo with Ayaka Shinha, or Mono Hydro with Furina Nuvolet, or Mono Pyro with Arlequino Bennett. Kazaha already provides insane damage boost to these teams. But with this mechanic of Xylanin, she is going to be an integral part with Kazaha and all of these teams, and it will be a rise of Kazaha Xylanin duo. But why is this so important? The thing is, Xylanin provides resistance shred with her skill. And Natlon Artifact set does not stack with Viridescent Veneer, meaning you are basically playing two Kazahas in the same team. At this point, it will just be an unfair fight against anyone we are going to face, right? So I think this is kind of something developers forgot to address or didn't thought of it sooner. But I believe this need to be nerfed because two Kazahas in the same team is too much already and the game is balanced around different characters and how we can play them. Xylanin is created to play with characters of different elements, so her being able to get tied to mono elemental teams just wouldn't feel right in my opinion. Plus it will make it difficult for those who want to play her as an on-field damage dealer, because then she will need to have at least three Geo characters in the party to do that. But what do you guys think? Do you think she's going to get nerfed? To be honest, even if they nerf it, I think it will be for the better as it will intensify players to go for different elements and reactions. I wouldn't even call it a nerf, as you will still be able to use Xylanin with Kazaha, but then other two characters will need to be of different elements. Anyways, that's the video. Make sure to like, share, subscribe. I just wanted to give my take on this mechanic. Almost everything else I said in this video still remains true. So if you haven't watched it, I will link it in the description. You should go watch it. And don't forget to do what Layla says. She's my lovely wife after all. Hi, I am Muharib's wife, Layla. My husband would be very happy if you leave a like, share, and subscribe to this channel. Don't forget to join our Discord server and he will see you in the comment section. Peace.